<clears throat> Greetings and salutations. My name is Tish and welcome to the Artist Haven, where home plus art equals heart. In today's live video broadcast, we're going to do a few experiments um, using a different pouring medium than what I'm accustomed to. So, um, I forgot what I was going to say. <laughs> I should forewarn you, I just got back from massage therapy and <laughs> I'm a little out of sorts um, because I'm just like a pile of goo right now. So <laughs> I appreciate some forgiveness. <laughs> so hello, Gina Bina. Good to see you. Oh, and also I am trying out my new microphone that I got. Um, so let me know if the quality is better, equal, less, too loud, too soft. And please keep in mind that each device is going to be different. And you might have to control your volume on actual YouTube or on your actual device or computer. So, um, anywho. Hello, Cynthia. Hello, Doris. Wonderful to see you all. So what I'm going to do is because, okay, so I've been doing balloon pours, right? And everything is out of stock. <laughs> like everything. I'm getting like desperate for supplies. Um, and so I was thinking, I'm like, well, why couldn't I use, I've got the, whoop, I've got the interior, exterior high gloss that I use for my balloon pours. And there's wetness on the bottom of this probably yeah it's just water so why couldn't i use that at, in place of um my liquitex whoops camera's over here i was trying to put it under the microphone that's how out of place i am right now here hear this um because <laughs> that's all i got and i i'm yeah so um I mixed it up like I do my regular pouring medium. I did um, an ounce of the pouring medium, which is in this cup. So it looks like marshmallow fluff. Um, that's why I thought it would work. Um, we'll see what kind of results we get with it, though. Um, so I used titanium white. So I did an ounce of, ounce of the medium, an ounce of paint, and then three to four ounces of Floetrol. Um, I did three for the other one. So we're going to be using Master's Touch Titanium White because I have a lot of that white. I went a little bonsai crazy. We'll mix one up too here. Um, but then I've got Master's Touch Lake Blue. Can you tell I'm trying to get rid of some of my Master's Touch? And all of them have about a trace of a three. So I don't know if you can see it with the with that blue, but I think you should be able to see it with the red. Um, but this is the Windsor Newton Galleria Crimson. This is a transparent. The um, This is a semi-transparent, and then this is an opaque. Okay, and then dioxazine purple is also an opaque, and well, that's the other color that we're going to use. But I'm going to bring this up and show you. Hello, Cheryl. Hello, Elisa. Hello, Lee. Good to see you. Um, let's see if I can get this close enough reflection. This is the one time I want to, I want the, the glare so you can see it disappears at about a count of three. I started with three ounces and then added another ounce or not for consistency. So, um, and I spilt paint on my scale again. Why is everything all wet? Dude. Hang on, let me grab a towel. It's going to bother me. Anywho, so I've got an ounce in here already of the high gloss stuff. And we're going to put an ounce of paint in there. And I started with equal parts. Um, and if I find that the colors are, are vibrant enough when they dry, um, then I will move to a half an ounce and see how that goes. Speaking of experiments, let me show you, after I get this mixed up, let me show you real quick 
um, the dried results from the experiment last week. So I'm just mixing this up. And the thing I like about this is it's white, so I can tell. The only problem was mixing it with the white. I couldn't tell, so I just stirred the hell out of it. So curfew at 4 p.m. Our curfew is 10 p.m., which we're on. Well, we just got released to have outdoor dining and um, salons can open. Gyms can't open yet. I misheard. I was so excited. I'm like, dude, I can go to the gym now because my HSA will pay for me to go to the gym. I just got to get my doctor to sign off on it, which he will, I'm sure. All right. There is that. And I'm noticing it's taking, it's taking that dark purple and making it fairly light. So we'll see what happens with it. Okay, I'm going to start with three ounces of Floetro. This has already been strained. There we go. Yeah, 3.1, close enough. Hello, Sir Whispers. How are you today? So wonderful to see you. Shane. Okay, I'll remember eventually. <laughs> I named my children and I can't remember their names sometimes. That's why they have like nicknames because I can remember the nicknames. I can't remember their given names. Okay, I'm gonna put another ounce in there because that's still a little bit thick. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna put this on here. So what I was thinking of doing is we'll do a straight up flip cup on one canvas and then I want to mix, um, I want to take out, I want to use the same color scheme, but I'm going to use, instead of using this red, I'm going to use this red and instead of this white, I'm going to use this white. This is, these are mixed with my other pouring mediums. So I want to see how it reacts with other ones. And then whatever is left over, we'll put a drop of silicone in it and see how it reacts with silicone. So we're going to do three really quick pours. I've got three 8x10 canvases ready. Um, part of the reason why I do three is because I already have the paint mixed up. I'm already here. I'm already making the mess. And then that way, um, if they all turn out nicely, I can sell them as a triptych. Okay, so my hand gets in the way. Sorry, I'm not left-handed. Still a little bit thick. We're, we're a strong three right there. So this is our color scheme right here. So next go around, we'll switch those. I don't think I have that sky blue mixed up in a different, but no, we want to do two and two. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, let's get the scale out of the way. Turn off. Thank you. I need a new scale. I gotta go scale shopping. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I needed a drink of water. I will drink that whole bottle of water in the next hour. Watch me. Because um, that's one thing the massage therapy does is it drains me. And I'll have to, like, pee as soon as this life is over. <laughs> okay, flip cups. Let's do three little flip cups. We're going to do three other little flip cups for the other one and for the other one. Oop. Oh, that was kind of a bonus. It fell, but it didn't land in the paint. Last time it fell, it fell right in the paint. <laughs> it's my little measuring cups. There we go. Okay. 
Now we're ready for that. So let's start off with a little bit of white. Normally I don't pour my cups on my canvas, but just for ease of use, we're going to this time. I'm put a little bit more red in that one. There we go. <clears throat> now I feel co fairly confident torching these if I need to um, because um, there is more paint and floral in here than there is of the actual house paint. So I'm not gonna torch them like super torch them. Put a little bit of white on the bottom too. There we go. So they're all about, that one's a little bit more full than these two, but that's okay, we'll put him in the middle. All right. Get my flipping aid. guy off. There we go. Okay. So all right. Next one we're gonna do I'm getting these ready <laughs> so I don't mess it up. Okay. I'm gonna grab my silicone too. Where'd it go? There it is. Okay. We're not going to put this. We'll put the silicone at last, but that way I remember what I'm doing. <laughs> All right. How is the audio, guys? Okay. Now I'm better. <laughs> Stupid sneezes. It'd be kind of interesting to see if you guys can hear me sipping on my water and stuff. That'd be kind of funny. Okay. Yeah, they're good. Let's start this one here. Whoa, okay. It's okay, that'll be tipped off anyway. Number two. Let's flip this one over. Totally missed that mark. That's okay.
All right, let's see how this goes. <clears throat> Okay, sound good, sound good, awesome, awesome. Sound is good. Um, no, I'm not, I don't have the earbuds. I have an actual um, microphone. Microphone. It's a free find microphone. It's on my wish list. Um, so if you want to see which one, I can share it in the group as well. Yeah, it's a little crazy. All right, let's see how this does. Let's go this way first. Since I wanted to get that little oopsie off of there. There we go. And we're going to go this way. Let's go back to the middle. There's a bubble right there. Okay, let's bring it around town. Okay, so I didn't shake the um, the gloss base, but I did stir it real good with the stir stick. Okay, we totally lost the blue. Let's see if we can get some kind of something going on here I don't like that cell right there all right Oof, got my tummy growling all right let's bring that back Okay, I don't like that corner, but I want it like that. So let's take the knife here. Hello, Sue. <laughs> Are you tilting your phone, Doris? All right, let's grab some of this right here. And we're going to kind of do... Bring some of that blue back. There we go. Okay, I'm going to torch this real quick. Then we're going to set it aside. One sec. Oh, Tish. Yeah, shuffle some things around here. Hang on one second. <clears throat> Where'd my torch go? There it is. <laughs> it's on the back table. Okay. Actually, let's put this back up there. There we go. So this is what we got for the first. This is all that pouring medium. The um, ultra deep base, interior, 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 oh boy, <laughs> but it's got some really cool cells going on, and that blue is kind of popping through, so there's that one, very light and wispy, okay, let's go on to canvas number two, but before we do that, let's grab Oy vey. Here we go. Grab a cup. 
I'm going to scrape up some of this paint. So it's not, I'm not elbow deep in paint when I get all done. It'll be an interesting color if I mix it all together. Okay. Let's get rid of these cups. And oh, I need paper towels. I used the last one that I had ready. up on aisle three. Okay. Ooh, that's really pretty. <laughs> there we go. Oh, there's a little bit right here. Let's grab that. There, now when we, for the next one, it'll be less messy of a cleanup. There we go. Still purple, but that's okay, I love purple. All right, so canvas number two. Drum, drum, drum. Okay. Um, the canvases that I have on my wish list, the I think they're called Mio. Or Miro, they are very nice canvases. Very nice. I am impressed with them. I was worried because I didn't want um, crappy canvases. Doug is such a pansy when it comes to the oh, 95 pound pansy. Yeah. Big dogs are the biggest babies, I swear. Gotta love them though. Okay, so we're gonna do the same order, but we're gonna use the regular pouring in the bottles. This is my regular mix of just flow chal and paint. Um, the red, whoa, that's a lot of white. That's a, that's a lot of white. We're going to dump some of that back. Okay. There we go. That one's, yeah, we'll dump a little bit of that back too. Since we're dumping back. Um, so this one has just flow troll and paint. And then this one has um, the, gla the um, glass medium. And it's a 50-50 mix of the um, Windsor Newton and the Liquitex Basics because I'm that girl. Okay, we lost the blue last time, so let's go a little bit heavier handed with the blue. Oh, I was going to show you the painting from last time. Oh, we'll do that while waiting for the flip cups. Okay, so we're going to shake this up. And I'm just going to squirt this in here. There we go. Okay. That back there. Let's put the lid on this before I spill it. And then we're going to put the purple in there. Not much purple left. 
Wonder why that is, Tish. <laughs> oh, I'll pour tater. All right, let's move these back. Get my flipper tool out. One. Two, whoop, three, whoops, see, even with the flipper tool, I'm still klutzy. My hand strength is getting better, though. I've been using my squishy poo and my little stress ball thing. Okay, so last week... And I will put the description, uh, the little um, I card in the corner up here um, so you can check out how I did this. But um, I mixed up my own, it was supposed to be kind of a, um, what are they called? The shift paints. And the black <laughs> is a got the high gloss on it and I love the cells in the corner and actually some of the red like some of this up here is really coppery and cool um and some of this red has a little bit of a sheen to it but it's not like bam in your face metallic so um once this dries another week or so I will put a clear coat on it and put some resin on it and see what it looks like because even if it doesn't do something cool I still think it's a cool painting so because it's got that little bit of purple in the corner down there and it's got these really cool cells right here and it's just it's just really cool so there's the results from that and this is this is I mean I can't explain it because the light doesn't pick it up but it's like it's like a brushed metal but red that makes any sense at all. Okay, so. Since. There we go. Squeegee it out. That's why I like Dixie cups for flip cups, because <laughs> I can squeeze out the extra paint. It's like squeezing a tube of toothpaste. All right. There we go. There's that one. Whoa, baby. Look at back there. There we go. There's one corner. Just the other corner. Okay. And flip this around. We're going to kind of elbow it up in here a little bit and flip it up. And we're just going to kind of meet this up here. All right, can I help that out? We're okay with that. Okay, get these out of the way. All right, so 
give this just a gentle rock back and forth. Okay, hang on. Let me get some of this purple over the edge. There we go. Okay. Okay, there is no silicone in this paint. All these awesome cells are just because of the paint and the different densities. Okay, so I'm going to bring this straight to that corner. There we go. Okay, I'm going to bring this kind of back again. This is the stubborn corner, apparently. There we go. And we're going to bring it back again. There. This one I'm not going to torch because I kind of like it just the way it is. And I don't want to have any more freckles on it than it already has. So. There we go. That blue came out a lot more. Maybe I just didn't use enough of it in the last one. But we will find out. So. I do like it. I like this one a little bit better than the other one. So this is a combination. This is, has two colors with the um, how interior paint and then two colors with the other pouring medium and flow chill. I'm going to put this on the back table here and let it chill out. Move that over a little bit. There we go. All right. We're going to do the same little bit of a cleanup here. Hello, Trey. All right, so let's do a little bit of a cleanup here. Because I need to have this thing dry by tomorrow night because tomorrow night we are doing a redo. Because <laughs> Brooke's been after me to do a redo on her, on her fish talk so um because she was nervous and she feels like she didn't answer all the questions the way she would have wanted to so because she's my friend and i love her we're giving her a redo tomorrow night and then um after the fish talk at 8 30 central i'll be doing a live over on trey's channel um, I don't have the link candy. I will put it in the description box um, after the live. I totally forgot to put it in there because, you know, blonde moment. All right, let's give this a 
wipe down. I don't think I need water this time. Let's get most of the paint off first. Here's me talking to myself. I carry on whole conversations with myself. It's like, okay, Tish, what are you thinking? I don't know. What do you think we're thinking? Okay, that's actually becoming really pretty. <laughs> it's kind of a... I'm going to put a little bit of water on here. There we go. I need to go to Sally's and get a bigger bottle because I go through that bottle so quickly. Especially when I'm painting furniture because I blend all the paint on, on the furniture. <clears throat> so, would you guys be interested in seeing some of my furniture that I've done? in the group um, I have another dresser and vanity that I want to get done but because I can't lift it <clears throat> I can't do it so all right now we're gonna take the scale out that's part of the reason why I wanted to have this clean because we're gonna take the scale out and we're gonna do silicone in all four colors. So I'm gonna measure out an ounce, if I have an ounce, hopefully. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. I can count. Okay, so, because I don't wanna mix it in the cup, I'm gonna do one ounce. Because there'll still be paint in here and I'll want to use this for other projects. Unless I decide I like the, the look of the silicone better than anything else. So there's one. There's two. <clears throat> Give this a stir. Okay, because all we need for the canvas is um, four ounces of paint. If I remember correctly, because eight by 10 is 80 divided by 28. I don't know. I'm not very good at math. <laughs> I know it's, I know it's less than 10. I think it's about it's like six. If Cause five, yeah, five ounces would be enough. Cause I'd be a hundred and some, so. Wow, there's barely enough in here. It's okay. Well, I'm just gonna scrape the rest of this out. There we go. There's still a little bit in there, but we might find a use for that. Okay, so we got all of those. Let's get this out of the way. Hopefully that didn't cause any feedback. Okay, and little dropper doer. <laughs> yeah, Trey, I got lots going on. One, one, so one ounce to one drop of this silicone. <clears throat> and I'm actually, I want to get the treadmill silicone. And what's the one that uh, Jilly uses? Um, I can't remember. I want to try, like, I want to use the exact same paints in the exact same um, pouring medium and use three different silicones and and see it, what happens. Because we've done experiments with, you know, dimethicone versus silicone um, in the same mixes. Ha! <sighs> 
Hello, Darnell. Good to see you. Yeah, I don't like that either. I don't. No one. No one likes it. I was watching Dean Newman last night, and he's like, "I don't like it." I'm like, "No, none of us like it, Dean." He's almost at a hundred thousand subscribers. I've been watching him since he was like, he just broke. I joined. I started watching his channel when he was just under ten thousand. I was there when he went to ten thousand, and then. Yeah, so I've watched him grow. I've watched Nick Nimmin go from 100,000 to googly googly amounts. Okay, so we're going to do three flip cups again. So. Squeeze this guy out. There goes the sirens. You guys probably can hear the birds and the sirens because I left my door open because it's like 85 degrees outside. So it's like a little bit warmer than that inside for me. I turned off my fan so you at least wouldn't have that. And I am by a fire station and um, a major freeway. And yeah, so... That doesn't help. Get all the paint out of there. See, there's a lot of paint still in there. There we go. Okay, that one's done. Then we're going to start with red on this side. So. And this is the Windsor Newton Crimson. Um, Lake Blue by Master's Touch and Master's Touch um, Titanium White and Dioxazine Purple, of course, by Liquitex Basics. It's my favorite color in the whole universe. Actually, I think I got that one good with the stick. That never happens. Dude. Yes, I call inanimate, inanimate objects dude, because I am that girl. All right, let's put some purple in there. Hello, Sandy. Oh, and you guys, I switched out my mouse now because it was fussed. I was trying to edit a video for last week and it was frustrating me so much. And I never got it edited because I was like, I need to find this mouse because I knew I had an extra one somewhere. So here's me digging in my closet trying to find this mouse. My cat's like attacking the back of my legs because, you know, Ray is a little ray of sunshine. <clears throat> mm -hmm. That's what I keep telling myself anyway. Although she is kind of fun. I got her a new toy that she just absolutely loves. She loves anything with bells. It's like anything that doesn't have bells, she has no interest in whatsoever. Ha ha. See? This is why I don't bother with clubs because I get it all over my arms anyways. I'm going to put just a little bit of white without the silicone. Just a little tiny, teeny tiny bit. Just a snoopty. There we go. 
just enough to help out. <laughs> What's going on? I am doing an experiment. Um, the first painting we did is I'm using the Sherwin Williams interior exterior high gloss that um, Johnny has on his channel for his bloom pores. So I'm using that color or that base in place of my normal base, the Liquitex Basics or Winsor Newton gloss. Um, so I'm using those and in that instead and just mixing it with that as my base and then flow trawl and paint. So if you want the exact recipe, um, have to hit replay or I will I will put it in the description box below too. I just didn't um, get that far. <laughs> so all right while we're waiting for this to do its thing I see some cool cells already. Okay. Absolutely Sandy. Absolutely. All you have to do ever anytime you come in just ask what's going on, and if I see it, I'll tell you, or if, um, you know, one of the ladies and gentlemen in the chat see it, they will let you know, because um, that's what I love about, um, that's what I love about this, this channel and the community that has been built here is that um, we have just the greatest people. Okay, well, why is that not showing up on the playlist? Hmm. Well, I'm just gonna do this. So, yeah, Chris uses the, the bench scraper. We're both are pastry chefs. Actually, we both went to the same school just in different cities, so. Yeah, I will do that. I, I will actually, when the live is done, I will go in and give you guys that. Um, so you guys have it. Um, I need to get better at doing that. Um, I just figure watch the, watch, <laughs> watch the damn video. <laughs> I know I'm awful. Okay, so here's me. Um, share the link. Okay. Hey, my computer didn't. You know, I get mine at the dollar store, so I have like 16 of them. Okay, so here is the link for um, Tish Talk. And that's tomorrow night at 7.30. And... And I can type. Hey. I know. I would love to see some of Chris's wife's stuff. I, I, I hope she will join in on the shenanigans because she's if she puts up with Chris, she's got to be an awesome lady. <laughs> I love Chris. He's like my my little big brother. Hello, Amber. All right, here we go. Flippity dippity. Give it a squeeze. And I'm just going to let this kind of do its own thing. I'm going to put the extra paint down here on the corner. Just like that. Actually, I should have done it over the corner, but that's okay. Okay, there's one. All 
There we go. No. Oop. Got the hiccups now. I've been drinking that water, I tell you. It's good for you, they say. Yeah, well, I don't have any lemons or limes. Because last time I was at the grocery store, it's like three weeks ago. Whoa, Bessie. Okay, you. Come in. Oh, that's a cool cup. Check that out. Okay, so we're going to do... You know what? I'm going to do this in the corner. Right here. Because I think we're going to have to stretch this one. Pretty far. All right. Clean up this mess. Let's get this a rock back and forth. Okay, let's tip it back. No, 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 no. There we go. Let's bring it back. Bring it down. There we go. We're going to bring it all down. <clears throat> okay, one second. I need to turn it. Bring it back a little bit. I'm going to touch up this side right there, just like that. There we go. Okay, we're going to bring this back just a little bit. Okay, let's start tipping it this way. Have any paint to help this along? There we go. Okay, we're going to bring this back again. All right, this one I'm going to torch. 
because I do want to see a little few more freckles in there. There's my towel. Yeah, I did use silicone in this one. And this one is all the um, the mixed ones, all of these, not the pre the other ones that I have. So we're gonna I'm gonna move these out of the way. So I can bring in. I remember to cover them because when I put them up, when I have paint up here, I remember to cover it. When I put it on that back table, I forget because it blends in with all the other stuff that's on there. All right. Yeah, see, I like the freckles in this one. Okay. So let's get our drippies. I don't think we have very many drippies, actually. Because I had a heck of a time. And that was three Dix three two ounce Dixie cups, not quite all the way full. So basically just under six ounces. I'd say five and a half. All right, so there's that one. And I have to say, the last two are my favorite, but You guys can decide because I'm going to put them all side by side and bring it over. So, hang on. See if I can get them oh, close enough. There we go. Oh, I forgot my stick. Hang on. There's my stick. Okay. So, here is all three, whoop, side by side. This one is just straight up pouring medium, the high um, ultra high gloss or ultra deep base, high gloss Sherwin Williams, um, the same paint that Johnny uses on his bloom pour mix, because um, I have like three quarters of a gallon of that stuff, <laughs> so I thought I'd try it out. This one's still pretty. Don't get me wrong, I love that one. The one in the middle is a combination of paints used mixed with my regular mix and then this new mix and then this one on the end down here um, um well it's my right um <clears throat> that one is the same mix as this with just a drop of silicone per one ounce of paint so that is that um if you enjoyed this video you found it informative please share it out on the interwebs get it out there on twitter and instagram and facebook um i didn't share it today because i ran it was running a little bit behind um so i didn't get that far but um <clears throat> um and then tomorrow night is tish talk with my pal brooke and then Wednesday night, we've got two new artists for Artapalooza. So you'll have to check that out. I've got that all set up as well. Um, I'll be posting that later today on Facebook. Um, if you are interested in joining our little tribe on Facebook, um, just go to at the Artist Haven. And that will lead you to the page. So smash the like button on the page. And then click the join group button. That's kind of pretty. That's just a scrapey cup. So, all right. Um, if you'd like to support the channel, we do have a PayPal account. We also have a Patreon um, where I'm going to be doing more than just what you see here. Um, I also have an Amazon wish list. So if you have a particular color you'd really like me to try, 
see if you can find it on my wish list and um, send it on over to me. And I'd, I'd love to try new colors. So, oh, hey, and if you're new here, I know I'm so awful at this. Golly jeepers, I should greet you when you come in the door. If you're new here, thank you so much for joining us today. Um, if you're enjoying our vibe and want to join a little artist tribe, all you got to do is click that subscribe. Thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate you. You're awesome. Be safe out there. It's crazy. It's scary. But I'm here with you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Really, I do. Remember, be kind to one another, y'all. Peace, love, and happiness.